bone. Not with the bone, it's on the wall. Give me the bone, dude. Done. Let's go find this village. Okay, I can't go that. What have we got here? Carried on, Kami will be ruined. I have to do something to stop them. Find no match for the sentry monsters, what am I to do? Hello, Wolfie, what are you doing out in the blizzard? I am a you, you must have such an easy, carefree life. What I want to give to be like you. I'm going to spend my days here living in fear of those monsters. What is it, you young man? You might feel better if you just talk about it. Oh, you have a Ponko with you. A white wolf and a Ponko? That's like the old legend. This must be the will of the gods. They must have told you to come here and help me. Nah, you got it all wrong, young man. I'm not. I find the whole young man seem a little patronizing. I've got a proper name, you know. It's called Wally. And we're with Eva. Stressed youngster Wally. Listen to my tale, Mr. of the gods. It all started just over a year ago. I was living in Wapkir, the village of the mountains. It's home to Katune, the divine sword that protects family. Because the village after all was treated with such so much respect, I couldn't help feeling curious that one day I touched it. I only touched it a tiny, tiny little bit, honestly. Ever since then, I seem to be cursed as bad luck. My sandals broke, I was rejected by the girl I liked. I banged my toe countless times, and an icicle fell on my head. On top of all that, this awful blizzard came along. Now the assassin monsters are out in the wild trying to kill me. I didn't want to cause more trouble, so I came to live here. Well, I can't believe you survived this long all by yourself. So what did those assassin monsters do to you? Well, it's very strange. You see, they're always staring at me from a way off in the distance. I know what they're up to, they're trying to break me emotionally. Then they'll come in for the kill, you have to help me, Wolfie. You have to get rid of them. See, here's a list of... What's of their names? Alex, another one of these fucking things. <sighs> oh, you sure are a serial young man. I see the goth place some kind of mark on the assassin monsters. You definitely know what know when you see them. They're very wary though, they only come out at night. They get rid of all of them for me so I can sleep peacefully again. Uh, no promises. About a 1 in 10 chance I should do it. I 
mess that one up. Yash pets, ready to look here. So I think I want to go this way then. Yeah. This is the way. Oh my fucking god, I am. No lie. Kind of exhausted, but. Whoa. Looks like the whole village had been frozen solid. Look at that. I'm kind of exhausted, but like I can't. I need it. I need to get more footage because I've actually pretty much run out. I have all, my, all the footage I already have done is already scheduled for release by Sunday. I need to get more ready for after that. I wonder if anyone's still alive. Sure they are. They always are. They're always alive. <laughs> Random ass clover. Oh. Let's go find the chief's house. I'm pretty sure that's where I need to go. Hey, I'm gonna come on. We got everything to do. Okay, then. I think we're gonna know the truth. Oh, see, so the chimneys are going, they're fine. It's kind of weird that the rhyme turns brown or about three of these animals, but whatever. Another mystery bead. Yeah, it's rolling badge. I can tell. Oh, let's go back down here. Very good, it's rolling badge. Oh. Uh. What if I do this? Apparently. Dude, let me read so I know what, where I need to go. Oh, you soon. This is bad, Morgana. Yeah. <sighs> 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 oh, 
Kill this Joe. How about over here? Oh, yep, I'll budge. Oh, wait a minute, there's a person here. Halt, who goes there? This is the house of the village elder. If you need something from the elder, you must go through me. I am Samical, top warrior of the only tribe. Only not tribe. Or the warrior Samical. Samical. Sheesh, why does this guy think who does this guy think he is? Well at least we finally met someone from the village. So what are you doing standing around in the middle of the blizzard? Hmm? A grating voice. Is that you we see? What you what in the world are you doing with that strange white wolf? That's none of your business, pal. Anyway, what's with this village? It's a total mess. Is it true demons have taken over Izu Fuji? This has been going for some time if you don't know that. So the question is for when you get back to your own village. That is of course if it hasn't already been buried by the snow. Oh, we'll take a suspicious wolf with you too. Aw, oh, you little... We're done talking to you. Let us into the chief's house now. No, you may not pass. We normally don't even let strangers into the village. And I've told the villagers not to let them into their houses. They will obey me for I'm Samakul, chief of Wakir. Now be on your way. No. Hold on a sec. You, chief? I have an old man, Kimu. He didn't buy the, far buy the farm, did he? Yeah. Well, of course he's still alive. But he's been greatly weakened battling the demons. Now their hideous monsters are trying to finish him off. So the elders of volcanic incantation can follow their plans. And that's why I became chief of the village. I will protect the elder from the monsters lurking in every corner. Now be on your way. I think Sonic Cole, you want us to make you? I see this extraordinary power in this white wolf, but if you do not heed my warning, I'll devour you where you stand. Now be on your way. So it's coming as a mule, I see. Come on, Ami. We, I thought it was a village. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Yes. Nothing to do here. Happy Fuji, a pair of Sigma Mountains. Okay. Demons out. Well, off I go. Oh well. Oh boy. Let's try to run over the place. So I guess I'm, I shouldn't, I shouldn't be here? What the fuck is this? Hey, wait. Hmm. You guys wait up. Well, I'll be. I've seen you in ages. You soon, is it you? What is you? So I heard you talking to Samako. I just thought I'd come back to see how things were after my trip. I can't believe what's happening to the village since I've been gone. And that Sonic still as stubborn as ever. When did he become chief? Well, what else happened this past year? Don't feel free if you stay outside too long. Why don't you come rest at my place and bring your white wolf too? At least cold, a bit more bearable inside. It's really been ages, hasn't it, you soon? It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance as well, Wolfie. I'm Kai. I knew the chick. We make girl Kai. This here is Amish Rasu, otherwise known as No Bath Ami. Now let's cut to the chase. There's so much I want to ask you. 
First of all, about these demons that are plaguing Kamui. What the heck brought that on? No one knows for certain. Twin demons, Lechku and Nechku. They were sealed away by a brave Oino hero years and years ago. And they have been enshrined in the Waku shrine ever since. Then one day, the sun lay stored and went berserk. A terrible blizzard descended upon Kamui. And he set out for the shrine at the top of the Fuji to pacify them. Then he killed him. He was no match for their evil magic. Sanako managed to get to him just in time and bring him back. Then they got even more violent and turned Ida Fuji into a glacier. They unleashed a blizzard to smother Kamui in a layer of ice and snow. She was Samako's trying to protect the village while Kimus recovers. And there's nothing we can do against the demons. You really are, you really are in a fix, old man. If uh, you really are in a fix, if old man Kimus players don't work. A beautiful twin demon summoned with berserk. We heard what sounded like an earthquake from Shinshu Field to itself. On that fateful day, Kiba declared that the evil force from himself and made its way here to Kamui. Kamui is sometimes called a land of hidden darkness. There's a legend that says all demons are born from this land. I wonder if all the world's demons are coming back to Kamui now. A black shadow passed overhead from the south recently and vanished to the Waku Shrine as if it had been swallowed up. Actually, I think the blizzard's been strong, stronger since then. Uh, there's something else I want to ask you. What's Oki doing with the sacred sword Katune? Saw him was it inside the village. I put old man Kimu let him take it at a time like this. Oh, you met Oki? He left here with our sacred sword the morning after it all started. As soon as Samako was chosen to take Kevin's place as chief, Oki just took the sword and left without permission. People from the village have tried to persuade him to bring it back. When Oki chases him off, he says he'll defeat the demons himself. So he's a dick. He has walked away with the sacred sword. He didn't yeah, even, even ask for permission. Well, I want to miss Oki the Great Warrior. Even Samako does. But it's impossible to defeat the demons all by, by himself. I just don't know why he did it. Not uh, now of all times. Okay. Oh shit, I'm sorry. Keep talking. When the sink guy, it's about Samako. He seems awfully nervous about protecting old man Kimu. It's because of Oki, isn't it? Oh, everyone's angry at Oki for taking the, sil taking the sword like that. But you see, well, Sanko would never say it. But he believes in Oki more than anyone else does. He's convinced Oki will come back and help the village. So then why'd he have to snap at us like that? He even told Furball here to get lost. The other day after the village was attacked by the demons. Lika went missing. Lika. As in Lika, your. That's right, my little sister. We scared the village in the scouring area, but we couldn't find her. She just vanished. Now, poor little Lika, too. Why would those demons mess with a little girl like that? <sighs> I don't know for sure if the demons are behind her disappearance, but they would certainly have a reason to seek her out. You see, Lika, Lika holds the fate of this village in her hands. The fate of this village? Well, that wasn't me. 